Hey everybody, ampreparaguy.com here. There's my phone number, 203-892-4119, my website. So we have a the Maritron AL811H, an older one, as you can see. It's the open frame relay. A uh, guy had 811 tubes in it, he had a failure. Um, this became resonant. He had an oscillation at one point. Took out the um, took some other components out. So I'm going to do the modification. Um, he had changed these when he had uh, when he had the failure. Took a tube out. He changed these and then had another failure. Took out the plate blocking cap, the choke. Um, I'm going to take out the resistors, put in the gas caps, and put in that resistor, um, the 200 ohm non-inductive type. He had added the parasitic board at some point. I'll go ahead and do all of that, get it done. I advise that he should put 572Bs in it, get rid of the 811s. So, okay, I'm gonna get to work. Hey, I'm back. I'm back with the completed amplifier. So, I forgot to shoot a video with it all apart again after I did the modifications underneath. I removed the grid loading resistors and I grounded each grid. I used a short piece of copper material to go from the grid to a new hole I drilled. One near each grid connection to keep the path nice and short. Some people like going through the screws on the sockets. I don't like doing that because if a nut became loose it's not good. Plus now you're going through the screw instead of having the connection directly to the metal. Change the plate blocking caps Change the plate choke. Added some solder where it was frayed at the board on each one. Now it's good to go. I also had to change the meter protection diode, but now it's good to go. Thanks for watching. Have a happy holiday. Take care.